Greetings and welcome back to AG2. Today I want to demonstrate to you a method to automatically log yourself into Pernet. I'm going to go ahead and hit yes. And now I'm here on the Pernet main screen. And if you click this tools, you'll see a record keystrokes. So if you click the record keystrokes, it's going to ask you, hey, let's save this keystroke file somewhere on your computer and your computer is none of these shown because this is a local C drive on the server that's what Citrix does for you it ports you into a a server location and your drive is a virtual drive so I'm gonna pick C drive dollar sign client V which is my computer and then you gotta give it a second and it will load all the folders on that drive and you're gonna go to users so you always wanna go to users and find your name and that's how you know that you're on your computer so once it finds there's my desktop I'm gonna save this um, QWS32 login folder call it log on and hit save so at this point it is recording and I'm going to go ahead and type in my password information and again it's recording each of my keystrokes And once I hit enter, I'm going to hit enter again. And at that point, I'm going to stop recording. And I think you can continue going on in the EDAS that way, but I'm just going to stop it per net. So now that I've recorded the keystrokes for per net login. I want to disconnect and then I'm going to go back into Pernet and without typing my password I'm going to try to access that logon file. And there it is. But once you get back into Pernet instead of typing your password all you will want to do is tell it to replay the keystroke file so I'm gonna hit connect and once I'm connected type in yes and hit enter and I'm gonna go ahead and type yes I'm sure you could have recorded the yes piece and hit enter but now that I'm here the keystrokes that I recorded were specifically for this screen and I want to hit tools replay keystrokes and I want to find my computer the C drive dollar sign go to users find my user folder and I specifically saved the file on my desktop and once I see the desktop there's my logon file and I'm gonna click open and I'm gonna let go of the mouse and it's gonna take care of everything else and it did it entered my pernet password and now I'm at the screen where I can uh, enter EDAS on the P4 region so again you can store your password in a keystroke file and access it through Pernet and enter that password in. Thank you. Have a great day.